Supposedly this is a tribute, but I've heard there may be more to it. Hey everyone, Jeremy here. Today I'm about to watch the Marvel Celebrates the Movies tribute uh, that just came out today. I'm not certain what's going on here. People have... I've seen a lot of people react to this as in, not, you know, do reactions. I mean, people reacting to this as in, oh my goodness, this was so good. So I'm very curious on what this is because it doesn't sound like it's just them patting themselves on the shoulder, which is all I thought it was going to be when it showed up in my feed this morning. But people are acting like there's a bit more to it, which even if it is just them patting themselves on the shoulders, I, technically Marvel kind of deserves it. <laughs> they've done an excellent job with their property over the past 13 years. Yes, it's been 13 years. I feel incredibly, incredibly old having found that out recently. Wow. But at any rate, let's find out what in the world this is. It's the most incredible Damn. thing in the world. What are you doing? Oh, this is nice. <laughs> that world may change and evolve. But the one thing that will never mm. change, we're all part of one big family. We are your brother that woman over there she's your sister higher further faster baby that's right you had to have stan near it part of one universe Wakanda forever! that moves ever upward and onward to greater glory I remember that reaction. I've lived a lot of lives. Really looking forward to that. But I'm done running from my past. We have unfinished business. Who's we? Can't wait for that too. Oh, I'm really looking forward to that. Number third. When you love something, you fight for it. Eternals. We're getting November? It is November 5th. It's the ones who changed everything. Fantastic forties. Fantastic forties. Okay. <laughs> the uh, whole Stan Lee narration got to me. I'm not afraid to say that. I love Stan to death. Uh, I have an autograph of him on my wall right now. Uh, uh, that was a great tribute. That was a, such a good tribute. <laughs> I joke about using Stan's narration, but that the comments that he was saying, that what he was saying, was so powerful and so true. To the heart of what's made Marvel so good. These aren't gods. These are people. These are your sisters, your brothers, your friends. And that's what has made the whole universe work. That is what 
made the MCU so relatable and why we love these characters so, so much. And the reveal. The reveal of the dates. That's awesome. It's awesome that we're going to get Marvel movie after Marvel movie here shortly. But then they're going to start spacing it out again. It'll be like every three months. And you know what? I can handle four Marvel movies in a year. I'm good with that. Plus, we're going to have Marvel TV shows in the interim. So, awesome. Yes, 100% in. Uh... The one thing that really stood out for me, other than, you know, we got a Fantastic Four tease there at the end. The four was in the background there. The, you know, the hint that, yeah, it's coming. Uh, but what was really, really striking me was Wakanda Forever. What a title. What a title. That is perfect. That is, I, I, I want that movie to be an absolute tribute to Black Panther. And... Chadwick Boseman, which I think that's what it's going to be. And that's what I've heard people say in interviews and such now, where it's going to pay tribute to the man plus the character and essentially not be about, you know, oh, here's a new Black Panther just right at the very beginning. I, I almost kind of picture it as something where maybe it's going to be, I, it's got to be Shuri. I think we're all saying it's got to be Shuri, right? But if someone does take up the mantle, it's going to be probably towards the end where it's not about that character becoming the new version of Black Panther in the first episode. It's about the journey to get there. And I'm in. I'm just in. And Eternals, finally our first look at Eternals, uh, which wasn't much. It was basically a bunch of people standing around in a barren landscape for the most part. But uh, I imagine they're still working on the VFX and everything else because it doesn't come out till like November, I think, was the date for that one. So... A lot of time, a lot of time yet for them to finish that up. And I'm, that's the one movie I'm really curious about. Like, what is it going to be? Because I know the Eternals least out of any character <laughs> at this point. So where are we going with this? All right. What did you think of this? Uh, I almost wanted to call it a sizzle reel, but this trailer, this tribute, uh, leave your comments below. Are you more excited or was there something that stood out for you that I maybe missed? Is there a release date that you caught that maybe I didn't love and thunder love and thunder which of these which of these are you most excited for now leave that in the comments below if you enjoyed this video please hit like and subscribe and as well as share this with friends if you think they might enjoy it all right and before I go as always please take care of yourselves and please take care of each other thanks for watching